to Brian Knobs of the Nasty Boys. And before I let him tell one story about Roddy, I'm going to tell you a story about me and Brian, which really was one of the breaking points in my career because I couldn't believe he had the nerve to do it. But this is the story. We're going to Europe, and I have my son with me. So I say to my son, I'm going to take a nap, keep an eye on Knobs. Well, he was dating Stacy Keebler at the time, and so he drifted off. So I walked up to Luger, and I said, Luger, keep an eye on Knobs. And, of course, that was ridiculous. He was doing something else, too. So I landed in London, and I woke up, and everybody was looking at me laughing. And I oh. said, what the hell? And I thought, what was going on? And at the same time, I went like this. I felt that my eyebrow was gone. My Ric Flair's eyebrow was gone. And at the very minute I started screaming, Knobs comes out the bathroom door with both his eyebrows shaved off and goes, God damn that Henning, wait till I see him. He shaved, trying to crack me like I didn't know it was him. He shaved his, his own, own. <laughs> to rip me <laughs> and blamed it on Henning. I was so mad I wanted to quit the company. <laughs> Who would shave Rick Flair's eyebrows? And I realized it was Brian Knobs. And he, and he was blaming it on Henning. That's amazing. But to get it over, he shaved both of them. <laughs> <laughs> I hate you to this day. Hey, by the way,